out here live with me this morning. We've got uh, Ken Gracie, owner of Parallax, and this is your latest uh, quadcopter, the V3 you've come out with. What do, you, what do you make of these new rules? Well, you know, we're an educational company, so we show people how to create, program, and fly drones, so we work with them from the inside out. So for our customers, I think they're okay because they bring them into the whole awareness of the industry, teach them basic flying and the safety rules, of, you know, below 400 feet, five miles away from airport. So I think that's really good. Um, but a little part of me is also concerned about the hobbyist customer that wants to experiment and might get a little bit out of control. That's right. And you know, a lot of people are probably going to be getting drones for Christmas. Maybe you asked for one. And uh, one thing to know is that even for the hobbyists, these rules are going to apply to a lot of those drones out there. But, but here's the thing. If your drone is like this one, less than half a pound, 0.55 pounds, a toy drone, you don't need to register it. But if it's over 0.55 pounds and less than 55 pounds, you need to register it with the FAA starting next week under these new guidelines. Tom, in the meantime, we are out here in Rockland this morning at Parallax Incorporated checking out one of their new drones. This this is a company that focuses on education and drones. So coming up in the 6 o'clock hour, we'll talk to them, get their thoughts on these new FAA guidelines and how that could impact education and innovation. Send it back to you guys. Okay. All right. Thank you so much, so Brian. You, is, is proper uh, etiquette uh, in your myths right now? Yeah, right now we're out here at uh, Parallax in Rockland where they actually design and build drones of all shapes and sizes. This one, not one of theirs, but what I want to show you this one for is the FAA announced yesterday that if you've got a drone that's over half of a pound, clearly this one is not, you'll need to register it. Over half a pound or under 55 pounds, the one flying behind me right now is about three pounds. That's the Parallax V3 built right here in Rockland. Commercial Commercial drone pilot or just a hobbyist, they're obviously regulating these things now. It's on you to know what those regulations are. And again, for comparison, that drone flying behind me there that one about three pounds the one in my hand here 20 pounds that even carries little robots it's got payload on here so that gives you a little perspective on what they're talking about most of the toy drones will fall under that half pound category and would not need to be registered but you definitely need to make sure before you go live out here in rockland at parallax brian hickey kcra 3 news wow that's a big drone